or the resources to be an expert in Amazon PPC. I would say the biggest thing to understand, everyone's gonna start at the basic level and you're going to need to start at the basic level. The basic level is understanding which levers influence things on the shopper end. You really wanna think about it like that. So for example, a lot of us, myself included, get stuck inside of advertising console, right? We're like, ah, oh, we have exact match, we have broad match, we got phrase match, and we have these campaign structures or these campaign structures. What you need to understand is that all of those things, budgets, bids, what match types we're using, affect where our advertising shows on the Amazon platform. And depending on where we're showing up, we're interacting with potential buyers is the end result with goal, of course, of converting those shoppers to an actual buyer. So if you can really in the beginning when you're in the basics, right, of like learning what does exact match trigger, what does broad match trigger, why do we set up campaigns this way, why are ad groups set up this way, try and constantly understand, okay, I'm putting this in the back end of the advertising platform, and this is where my ads will appear based on the things that I'm doing on the back end in the ad console. That's pretty important to understand. I would say that's the first layer. If you can start off your Amazon ad journey really trying to connect those dots, that will be very helpful. The other layer that you're going to get into is once you've kind of understanding what's what and what is where, is you're going to want to understand analytics very heavily. Um, you want to understand the interactions between things, um, sort of the numbers behind the numbers. So for example, things like ACOS, right? You start looking at, to do proper analytics, you want to look at the building blocks of those numbers. So for example, in ACOS, it would be ad spend divided by ad sales. You want to understand that dynamic and understand that that's a division problem, which is also a fraction. And in fractions, if you reduce both the numerator and the denominator, it is still the same fraction. Meaning if my ad spend decreases at the same rate as my ad sales, I don't actually improve a cost at all. So you're starting to understand those interactions between the numbers, what number, again, what things influence each other. That would be the third layer. And then, or the second layer. And then I would say the third layer, which was actually an answer to a question. If you are specifically talking about how to become an expert and really desirable as to be employed to manage Amazon advertising. Now, if it's just you're managing it for yourself, I would say focus on those two layers. But if you're looking to have a career in Amazon ad management, I would say the third layer and arguably the most important layer to have is leveling up your communication skills. Good communication skills, regardless of whatever career path you choose, are going to make you significantly more valuable as an employee. And so 